Bro, I had to start it over, bro, because the camera keep on. I keep on. Yeah. The camera keep on. Camera. I keep on. Matthew 24 verse 14 But he that shall endure unto the end The same shall be saved And this gospel of the kingdom Shall be preached in all the world For witness unto all nations And then shall the end come Yeah this gospel shall be preached unto the nations And as a witness then shall the end come Now you see the end manifested Because of the prophecies that are coming to pass You know You see Esau, America trying to invade um, Venezuela and Russia and um, all these other nations stepping in, yeah. mainly Russia, because Russia, in the, in, in the book of Ezekiel, the 39th chapter, that Russia will be a guard onto these nations. Yeah. Libya, um, Ethiopia, all these other nations. You see Russia now stepping in, because um, as according to the prophets, because you know, Russia is going to be a guard onto these nations. Yeah. You know, and that's what's going to kick off World, world, world Three. Huh? You know, ultimately, when they go into Iran, you know, because America desperately wants to go into Iran, yeah. but they know they just can't go into Iran because they know they got the backing of, um, they know that Iran has the backing of Russia and yeah. China and all these other nations back, you know, but eventually it's going to be kicked off by them so-called veterans and so-called Jews, you know, they're going to be the ones that kick this thing off, you know, like, uh, the devil is too. They, they, got, they knew the prophecy too, bro. On the left hand side, they knew the prophecy. They knew that as soon as they step in the Iran, that's, that's, hey, that's it. That's the beginning of the third world war. But they're going to go godless. Why? Because that's a prophecy. That's a prophecy. But the devil is too. Uh, matter of fact, uh, Proverbs 21 verse 1 says that uh, the king's heart is in the hand of the Lord as uh, the river of living water to turn him for that's what they will. So the devil, right. they are controlled by the spirit of Yahweh Hashem on the left side, man. What do they do? What do they know they're not, you know? Yeah, that's right, you know. But the Mosai, the Mosai is the king chess player, you know? The Mosai is the one that, the Mosai is the king chess player. He's the, the master chess player, you know? He's the one that's moving the pieces on the boards. He's the one that's setting the boards. He's the one that's setting the boards. He's the one that's in the situation. You're making the moves. You know? Yeah, that's right. He's shooting. 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 He's Daniel chapter 4, <laughs> verse, uh, verse 17. And it read, This matter is by the decree of the watchers, and the demand by the word of the holy ones, to the intent that the living may know that the most high, Yahweh, by Hashem Yahushai, ruleth in the kingdom of men, and give it to whomsoever he will, instead of over the base of men. That's right, the most high ruler in the kingdom of men. That's right. He give it to whoever, whosoever he pleased. Yeah, it does. You know, he did, he just now gave it to Esau. Because that was this is the time where Esau ruling. You know? This is the time that it was already prophesied that Esau would be ruling in this time. But now he's at the end of his rulership, you know? That's a prophecy. That was a prophecy to Esau by Isaac. That's right. So now this devil's at the end of his rulership. Now that he's going on crazy, you know, he's, now he's trying to establish quickly his new world order because he knows that his time is short. That's why you're seeing all these outbreaks going on, all these uh, pandemics, you know, going on over there in New York. You see these outbreaks, these sicknesses, these pestilence. You know, that's what our Lord was talking about, that there should be earthquakes, 
the famine and pestilence and diverse places. You know, that's the prophecy. So you, you're seeing earthquakes and um, you're seeing earthquakes, famine and pestilence in diverse places. All throughout the people. All throughout the people and all throughout the four corners of the earth. Yeah, it So that's prophecy coming to pass. Yeah, matter of fact, went to 2nd Ezra. That's right. 2nd Ezra. 2nd Ezra 15 verse 1. And he reads, Behold, speak thou in the ears of my people the word of prophecy which shall put in thy mouth, saith the Lord. That's right. We're speaking in the word, in the ears of the words of prophecy. You know? We're speaking prophecy when we come out there. That's right. We're telling you, thus saith the Lord. You know? We're telling you that there are people, there will be a thermal nuclear holocaust in the near future. We're telling you that there's going to be famines. There's going to be outward dead bodies throughout the streets of America. Pandemics, outbreaks, you know? Men, sedition among men. You know, sedition among the government. You know? It looks like uh, when you get down to a sedition, a price. That's right. The, the, the rich making families, you know, the Rothschilds, the Oppenheimers, the Dupont, the Rockefellers, the devils. That's right. You know, they're not in the interests of the people, they're in the interests of the um of the elites, elite, you know, the banking families, the banking family, because at the end of the day, America is not a country, it's a corporation. Corporation, you know? Yeah. America's That's why we got social security cards. Yeah. That's why we got birth certificates, yeah. you know? That's what you that's why you need permission to travel. That's what you need. The, that's why you need a passport. You know, that's right. drive a license because you're a slave. You know, to the to the to the banking families. You know? That's right. You know? Yeah. That's why when you commit a crime, or if, we, if you kill another person. They don't arrest you because you killed that person. They arrest you because you done took money out of their pockets. You know, they're they're a tax paying person. You know, they already they already owe money to the um to the state to the federal government. So when you take that person money, you're taking money out of their pockets. So therefore, you're stealing money from the elites. That's why he's saying you paid your debt to society because you're not you don't now took on that person's debt yeah. that person's debt is not being placed upon you now that's why they put you in prison that's why you're state property that's why you become state property that's why you know like uh, the majority of the prison system they are they are the one most of the work they're working for for donors you know, for uh, you know, making license plates you know, uh, 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 because like once you go back to the prison that's all uh, you pretty much become a slave all over again that's right you know, you know? No wish, you, you have no, no rights, you know? That's exactly how it is. That's how they play the game, you know? Yeah. That's when, you know, that's when when you come out, you know, you already got a record. Now you can't get a job, you know? Now you can't support your um, your family, you know? You can't even support yourself. Yeah, because you have a record attached to your name. You can't go anywhere to apply for a job because as soon as you go apply for a job, they're going to ask you, oh, have you been to prison? That's <laughs> right, know? you know? That's that's the trick. That's the net yeah. the snare that the devil Are you a convicted people. felon? Mm -hmm. You know, are you a convicted felon? Yeah. You know? That's the net snare that the devil has set up for our people, man. Yeah, then they run your background. They run your quarry. And they got to say, we got to do a quarry check. You know, we got to check your quarry to yeah. see if you're clean. You now, when they check your quarry and they see all that you got all these criminal you background. Know, background, you got a criminal history, they don't want to hire you. Yeah. Then what? Yeah. Now you're resorting to going to the te these temp agencies, which you ain't gonna make much, you know, working for these temp companies. You know, you're just gonna make enough barely to eat for the day. You know, just to, just to eat for the day. But what about you know housing? You know, transportation. You know. Now these, these these Israelites, man, they had a major part in our downfall. Yeah, and putting us in slavery. Yeah, man. Yeah, come. So when we get into power, we're gonna put their daughters and their sons into slavery. Yeah, that's you know. Right. Yeah. Boy, I can't wait for that. <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey, all all y'all nations, y'all gotta pay for what y'all did to Yasha Allah. For the sign, you know? Yeah, y'all gotta pay. Y'all you know, yeah. gotta have a price to pay. Yeah. Yeah. That's and it's past due. It's past due. It's past due. Yeah. 
matter of fact, I'm going to read Joel chapter 2, verse 1. For behold, in those days and in that time, when I shall bring again the captivity of Judah and Jerusalem, I will also gather all nation and will bring them down into the valley of Yahushaphat and will plead with them there for my people and for my heritage, Israel, That's whom right. they are scattered from them. Yeah. Yeah. Which means Armageddon, the Lord's judgment. The, 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 yeah, the, the, the valley of decision. Yeah, valley of decision. Yeah, the Lord's decision. Yeah, you know, over there in the east, the Middle East, you know. Yeah. So the Most High is strategically setting up the board. Yeah. And the Most High is little, surely but little, just making the um, little move. You know? That's but right. ultimately, that big move is coming. Yeah. You know? Yeah. You saw it's going to happen. It's, gonna, it's about to make that big move. Yeah. That's going to set off the whole world free. Yeah. Even in, in, uh, down, down there in uh, Venezuela, the devil is trying to go down there. Especially so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So he's so proud. So he wants to go down there. Yeah, but, uh, they know, he, he knows that too, like uh, Russia and, uh, and uh, China, they have the invested in the Venezuelan economy. That's right. You know? Yeah, so they, um, Russia and China, you know, they got a lot of money invested in oil. Yeah, you know. And Venezuela is one of their main ex exports of oil that they're invested in. Yeah, not You know, that's just one of them. And Iran. Iran. Iran got a lot of oil too, yeah. in which. And Russia and China has a lot of money invested there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this yeah. thing is going to set off. Yeah, you know? That's right. The most is about to set this thing off. The, the stage has already been set, man. It's only a matter of time before all that break loose. That's know? right. Before, you know, that major yeah. move gets, gets, um, gets made. You know? It says, uh, I will also gather all nations <laughs> and bring them down into, into the valley of Yahushaphat and will plead with them there for my people and for my heritage in Israel whom they have scattered among the nations and put it my name. That's right, you scattered us amongst the nations, you know? When you Ishmaelites got together with the Amites and gathered and rounded us up and sold us to the so-called white man, you know? And the white man dispersed us throughout the four corners of the earth, you know? You know, that's that, that that's because of you. You know, y'all y'all had a hand in it. Right. So now the most high is gonna gather all you nations. That had a hand in that, and we're gonna bring you down, and we're gonna plead with you, and just silently judge y'all at the same time and destroy y'all. Gonna kill you because, like, when you, uh, when you go down to the word plead, you need to, 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 to kill. Yeah, yeah, to kill. Yeah, you. yeah. The most side, the most side is against you, nation. <laughs> yeah, good, yeah. good. Yeah. Verse three, and they have cast slurs to my people, and have given a boy for a harlot, and sold a girl for wine that they might drink. That's right. These preachers, they cast lots for our people. You know. They sold, you know, y'all, y'all got sold, y'all traded, y'all traded us to the so-called white man for months and guns and wine, and wine, you know. That's what y'all did. Yeah, and that's that's in the Bible. That's that's, you know? that's why he's so trying to. That's why he's so uh, has to move the Bible out of the school system because he knows, uh, like, uh, in the in the latter days, that the truth will eventually come out. You no, know? that's right. That's the history. Yeah, you know, because the the, uh, the so-called white man got a greedy system. Yeah, that's right. That's right. That's why they had to re-edit it and refine it, you know, and switch up the words, you know, because they're trying to hide the truth, you know. They already done took the Apocrypha out of the 16 and 11 edition Bible, but now they want to refine and re-edit, you know, the King James Version Bible. Uh, into the new you find version, you know. That's why, you know, years ago we had this so called nigga that was a um that was a Muslim coming up, you know, trying to challenge us, you know. Talking about yeah that Bible be re edited and re refined and all of that so it can't be the truth. You know? But there's a reason why it's being re edited and re refined. It's because Esau he's trying to hide the truth. Yeah. He's trying. He's adding, and he's taking away from the um from from the book. Hey, that's that's a cut too for your, for your so-called Christian uh or people that like to say, oh, the white man, uh, the Bible is a white man's book. If it's a white man's book, why does Israel have to remove part of the Bible? How, why don't you have to add it to get part of the Bible out? Because you know the Bible condemns them. That's right. You know that the Bible condemned the, the so-called white man. They have the Bible speaks of man, and they are going to serve it. That's right. For the crimes. In the trust they have communities for the side, so called black, Hispanics, and the Americans. Yeah, well said, you know. Because if it was the so called white man's book, 
Yeah, why is he adding and taking away from the scripture? You know, because he knows that this is not his book. He knows that this book belongs to the Israelites, which are the people on the side. That's right. You know, because says, uh, and they have cast lots for my people, and have given wine for a harlot, and sold a girl for wine that they might drink. Yea, what have you to do with me, O Tyrus, thy don? In all the course of Palestine, will you render me recompense? So the Lord's asking them, he's making what I've done to do with me, O Tyrus, thy don? Recompense me? Yeah, let me see. I've got a sign, though, Jim. Are you going to pay the Lord back for what you've done to his people? Yeah. Huh? That's a question. Yeah. It says, uh, the answer is no, you're not going to pay the Lord. <laughs> so this is what the Lord's going to do to you. Yeah. It says, uh, yeah, what have you to do with me, Otari and Zidon, in all the course of Palestine, will you render me a recompense? And if you recompense me swiftly and speedily, will I return your recompense upon your own head? That's right. Will the Lord return his recompense upon your own head? And the answer is yes, he is going to return the recompense on your own head. What have you done to the nation of Israel is going to be done unto you. No, unto your offspring. Yeah. Unto your children. Yeah. No. Yeah. As thou hast done, it shall be done to thee. Thy reward shall be turned upon the own head. So right. whatever the devils have done to the people on the side, guess what? It's gonna happen to you twice, double. That's right. And that applies to you so-called handbites and you Israelites, you know? Because y'all were in league with the so-called white men. Yeah. So you're gonna get it too. You're gonna get it as well as the so-called white man. No? Huh. It says, uh, because you have taken my silver and my gold and have carried it to your temple. Yeah, that's what you did. You've taken the silver on our silver, the Lord, the silver and the gold and carried it to your temple. You know, right. back during the time of um, Titus, when we fled out of the land of um, Vespasian. Titus Vespasian. Mm -hmm. You know, when we fled out of, um, out of um, Jerusalem yeah. into Africa. 78 feet. 78 feet. We fled into Africa. We done took the gold. We done took the silver. Yeah. We took it. We carried it to the pleasant temples. Oh, they also got off the neglect are compared to gold. That's Those right. Are people, the, the, the people that you stole, they are compared to gold in the eyes of Yahweh Bash the creator of heaven and earth. That's right. You know, that goes back to the law. You know, he that stealeth the man is celebrating. And if he be found in the sands, he shall surely be put to death. Hey, there's no way that these devils can make it, man. That's right. That's right. Them, man. You know? There's no way Esau can make it. Esau broke all every, every law that Yahweh Bash tried to set up for. There's no way in hell that these devils can make it, man. That's right. You know? And now that, that applies to you, Hamites and you Ishmaelites. You Ishmael. know? But I think the Ishmaelites. After after they serve the slave a thousand years, they're gonna yeah. they're gonna have their lands. They're, yeah, they're, 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 they're gonna be under submission. Mm -hmm. But but he's sort of uh, uh, utterly destroyed. Yeah, he's, he's the cancer of the earth. Yeah, yeah the hammer of the earth. Yeah, he's the, 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 the destroyer of the earth. Cut. You know? He doesn't want to give. He he's he's against, he, he's against nature. Yeah, that's right. You know everything this devil does is, does is against nature. That's right. Cut. Look at this homosexuality. Yeah. Bestiality. Yeah. You know. Yeah. But like what I want to do. You know. Hey, that's what him not honoring the land sabbath. Here it is that there's a land sabbath. You work the earth for six years and you let the earth rest on the seventh year. But what does this devil do? He works the land, he works the land, he works the land, he works the land until there's nothing left of the land, you know? Because, and that's why the land cannot, cannot uh, yield its profit. Yeah, that's right. That's why you got grapes the size of pebbles, yeah. you know? Good. Where it took, back in the ancient world, where it took two strong men to carry a cluster of grapes, yeah. you know? <laughs> it took two strong men to just carry a cluster of grapes back in the ancient world. Now, now there has to be some heavy grapes right yeah, there, huh, you know. So now look at the current condition of the earth, man. Yeah. And that's what says that the earth also is defiled under the inhabitants thereof. But I don't find that twenty fourth chapter, the sixth verse of Kushan. Yeah, let me get the twenty fourth chapter. Right yeah, there. the sixth verse. Yeah. Come on. You know that's a. Uh, that's the current condition of the whole earth under the worship of the devil, the super white man. They have what the Bible speaks about. Yeah. So Isaiah chapter 24, verse 6. Therefore hath the Lord, therefore hath the curse defiled the whole earth. So it says, therefore hath the curse defiled the whole earth. So the Edomites are the people of the Lord's curse. Therefore, because they are in worship, the earth is under their violation. So the earth is cursed under their worship. Right. And they that do 
world therein are desolate. Therefore, the inhabitants of the earth are burnt and few men left. Hey, that's the current state of the world. Because the uh, fraud of the universe too, and the righteous are not only the people rejoice, but when the wicked bell fall, the people mourn. So, in, in the, under the relation of the devil, everybody got you hell, man. Everybody's got you down under, under, under the world. Even the earth is crying for the worship, man. That's right. That's why you had that Edomite that came, that Edomite um, damsel that came. Yeah. I need the Lord. I need the Lord. Yeah, you know that that that's you know that's because the earth is mourning right now. People are mourning. Get your money. You no, know? yeah. people are mourning. Yeah. People are tired of the condition of the society. People are tired of the ways of the society. Even their own people are tired of the, the condition condition of the of the earth. You know. Sure. All right, verse 7. The new wine mourneth, and the wine and the fine language. Verse 6. Let me start at 5. Isaiah chapter 24, verse 4. The earth mourneth and fadeth away. So the earth mourneth and fadeth away, man. The earth is mourning right now. The earth is mourning for 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 the worship. Why? Because the devil they don't take care of the earth, man. Because the Lord Yahweh Hashem Shai got the Bible as a manual on how to govern the land. But the devils, they cast the Bible on the side. They don't, they don't, they don't use the Bible. Meanwhile, they come up with all kind of uh, 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 what do you call it? Uh, all kind of uh, amendment every day. On how on how to to fight the wicked deeds, man. You know. That's right. Fun. The world language and fade of away. Mm -hmm. The haughty, the haughty people of the earth do language. Fun. Verse five. Yep. The earth also is defiled, defiled under the inhabitants thereof. So they said the earth also is defiled under the inhabitants yeah, thereof. Man. So who put to the earth? The Edomites, the so called right race. You know, pursuant to Job 9 verse 24. The devils under the, under the worship, the power structure, the earth is defiled. The earth is looking for a new worship, a new management, a new people, man. And that's why our Lord Yahweh Shai, who in English called Jesus Christ, has to come to give his power to his people, so called black spin, the Great American power and dominion to the earth and righteousness. No? That's right. Because they have transgressed the law, huh. changed the ordinance, they and have broken the everlasting covenant. They have transgressed the law, shared the ordinances. You have daylight, uh, daylight saving time. You know, hey, that's 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 a, a new thing that came under the worship of the devils. You know, that's a new way of uh, of doing things under the worship of the devils. Because uh, this guy, Alexander the Great, for talking to himself. He said, uh, what the devil is going to do is give the power. Wickedness was more than the earth. So everything that the Lord says not to do, when the devil gives the power, they pretty much push the law to the side of the other side and come into all laws. That's what the devil has done. Come to take So it's the book of Psalms. Chapter 50, verse 16. Yeah. And it says, But unto the wicked, the most high said, What hast thou to do to declare my statutes? So the Lord, the Lord Yahweh Bahashim Yahushai is asking a question. But unto the wicked, the most high said, What hast thou to do to declare my statutes? So, yeah, what, what do you have to get the Bible to the link? So, what do we give Proposition 50. You know the Bible to the link. No, we might have a uh, homosexuality when you are free. No, that pedophilia is all time high. No, the devils do everything. That's what we call them devils, deceivers. So they have, they have done everything contrary to the law of the Lord Jesus Christ. That's right. Or that thou should have taken my covenant in thy mouth. Yeah. What do you, what do you have to do to take the Bible, to make the Bible to the land? Because you're not gonna obey any law of the Bible. Why do you have to do that? Because you're the devil. Seeing thou hateth instruction Come. and casting my word behind thee. So the Lord said, seeing thou ha, that has hate destruction. Because the devil, they don't, they, don't, they, don't, they don't like to follow the Lord. The Lord. They don't come up to the whole law because they hate destruction. They are rebellious. You know? That's right. They cast my word behind thee. So they cast the word of the Lord, the commitment of the word behind them. And they come up to the whole law. When thou see a big thief, then thou consider the him. Yeah, come on. Has been uh, partakers with adulterers. Yeah. Verse 19. 
Thou givest thy mouth to evil, and thy tongue frameth deceit. Thou giveth thy mouth to evil, and thy tongue frameth deceit. And that's how the devil has managed to over the country, the natural source of the whole earth, to lie, deception, and, and deceitment, wickedness. You know, that's how they have managed to the, the portion of the earth. You know, John today thinks that the thief cometh not but steal, kill, and destroy. That's exactly the evil of the devil. That's right. Verse 20. Thou sittest and uh, speakest against, against thy brother. Huh, Thou set, slanders thy own mouth, not the son. Thou slanders thy own mother's son. So, uh, who, who are your, your mother's son? Us, the yeah. Israelites, so called black Christians and the Americans, contrary to popular belief, we are, mostly, uh, we are more closely related to the, the super white men than, than those are uh, the Hamites. So right. because we have the same uh, form of right. uh, Rebecca, Rebecca and, uh, and uh, Isaac, right? Yes. That's what they did. But that was, they are jealous that the Lord how God should chose us instead of them. That's why they have a perfect relation for the speaking of the Son, man. The whole, my the whole of many to, to destroy these people, to destroy the people in the Son. Because they are, because they are, they are how God should chose us. That's right. They're the vessels of the dishonor. That's why, you know, that's why everything that goes on in the earth, you know, it's all about the sun. Hey, you know, you know how you do this on the way get the devil? Everything that the devil does is on the left hand side. Right. <laughs> everything, everything the devil does is on the left hand side. You know, when you, 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 you drive your car from the left, you know, the Western civilization, way of life, when you go right from, from left to right, everything right. the devil does is from the left. And that's how you know the, the word uh, left or uh, sinister. Yeah. That's, that's, that's how uh, you get the word uh, you know, uh, you know, uh, from life. Yeah. Yeah, 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 just look at the culture. Yeah. The culture in itself is enough. Even, even the own language. The own language. The, the English language is a vast language because it's mixed by so many, with so many languages. Yeah, that's right. You know? And plus, how, how do you read it? You read it from left to um, left to right? To right, yeah. But you were in the Paleo Hebrew, the Paleo Hebrew is read from right to left. Yeah, you know? yeah that's, 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 that's how you read it. That's how yeah, that's that's right. the proper way of Even the language is left. Yeah. Like, yeah, that was this bastard th tongue that we're speaking. Yeah, you know? Yeah. Yeah, man. That's, yeah, that's, that's what it is, man. Yeah, tongue. And that's why our Lord Yahweh Shama Shayak, who you ignorant because Jesus Christ has to come to give his people, the Israelites, so called yeah, black right. spirits. Yeah, Native Americans, the uh, elect, power and dominion to the world, man. You know, quite, you know, quite. So, verse, uh, verse 5 because you have taken my silver and my gold and have carried unto your, your temple my goodly pleasant things, the children of Judah and the children of Jerusalem. So, the children of Judah are uh, Judah, Benjamin, the Levi, the children of Israel, another you know, kingdom. All the way down. Have you so good onto the Christian? The Christian are the, are the so called right race, the, the South Portland white race, the Edomites. You know, because there, there's, nothing white, there's nothing white about them. Because the word white, you know, pure, innocent, angelic. There's nothing white or uh, pure, angelic about the devil. Right, just the wicked. And the people are so much cursed. It says, uh, Behold, I will raise them out of the place where they have sold them, and I will turn your recompense upon your head. So that's what this is taking place in the house of David. Through the Amos 9 verse 11, it's been raised up. You know, the elect, yeah. you know, hopefully, the elect of the sign are raising up 
to the to the spirit of the how bash you know shy you know out there in the high hedges you know trying to wake up the the the, 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 the that's exactly what we're doing. No? We are made a spectacle to the world, into angels and into men. So hey, what we're doing, what we're doing out here is, is a prophecy. You no know, prophecy being fulfilled right in front of people's lives, but they don't they don't pay attention. They don't know what time they end. No, but it's beautiful. No? It says uh Behold, I'll raise them out of the place where you have sold them, and will return your recompense upon your head. And I will sell your son and your daughters into the head of the sick, children of uh <laughs> and I will sell your sons and your daughters into the head of the children of Judah. So hey, what how what how has what thou has done to show up you don't know to be. And that's exactly what's coming. You know? That's exactly what's coming. You know? Uh and uh, that's uh Revelation 13 and 9, 10, if any, if any man have an ear, let him hear. He that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity. So whatever you have done to these people, guess what? It's going to happen to you twice, double. You know, because it says uh, we want to reward them double. You know, this, these are the people of the Lord. Yeah, how about Shema Shai? The Israelites talk of black skin and the Americans. That's right. Reward them double. Yeah, you know, double trouble is coming to Esau. Double trouble is coming to Esau. I like that. <laughs> that sounds beautiful, bro. <laughs> double trouble is coming to Esau. Who is Esau? The super right race, the devil that the Bible speaks about. That's right. That's why he knows, you know? That's why he puts it in the um, movies. That's why it's called predict Predictive Program. Yeah, Predictive Program. It's like that movie Planet of the Apes, you know? It shows you, you know, this devil being judged. You know, according to the scripture, you know, when that scene in the first one, the first planet that ate was with Cornelius, you know, <laughs> when he went, um, what's his name, called him up there to read his judgment, Esau's judgment, you know, that's how Esau's going to be judged, by the law of the book, by the law of the book, you know, read to him the 29th scroll, 6th verse, <laughs> that's how it's going to be, you know, that's how this devil's going to receive his judgment. Yeah, 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 but they know, they know it. I mean, the, the, the upper elite, they, they, know what, they know what time it is. But the regular white people, they don't know, what, they don't know what's going on. You know, they are they are yeah, lost in the sauce. Yeah, they don't know what's yeah. going on, man. But it's beautiful, man. Because uh, when the judgment finally comes, they're going to be cut off guard, man. You know? That's right. You know, when it, when it comes, they're going to they're gonna be caught off guard. I mean, the peons are, you know, but... Yeah. You saw the, these upper elites, you know, these higher class um, Edomites, you know, that run the world, that owns the banks, that controls how much you pay for your rent, you know? Yeah. You know, these they're, they're going to be, be the ones that takes up on that, that slavery, you know? Yeah, huh. You may get that from Psalm 75. Psalm <laughs> 75 verse, verse, uh, verse 6 so they read for promotion cometh not from the east nor from the west nor from the south but how about Shemesha the judge he put up down one and set up another that's right he put up down one and he set up up another you know who he's going to put down he's going to put down the so called white man and he's gonna set up the nation of Israel, Yasha Allah. That's who he's gonna set up, you know. You know, we're gonna be the ones that um, that's gonna be set up. But only this time, once we get set up, we're never gonna go back down. Yeah. There's not gonna be a thing of Esau rising up, you know, and taking us down and putting us in slavery. Never again. Never ever again. This is the last merry go round right here. We have a thing that oh never never again. Hey, this is a place for us. Never again will the devil take us down. Never again will you be able to touch our women. Yeah. You, know? you ain't gonna be able to touch our women in the, in the kingdom of heaven. Right. Nor are you gonna breathe on them. You're gonna be able to breathe on them. That's right, good. You know? Yeah, good. Uh, Psalm 75 verse 8. For in the hand of the Lord, Yahweh Bashino Shai, there is a cup, and the wine is red, it is full of mixture, he pours the same, but the dread dog shall all the wicked of earth. Or wake them out and drink them. That's right. You're gonna drink of that, the of that cup. Yeah. You know, 
know, start with what you eat around. Yeah. You know? You're gonna drink every thread of that cup, you know? The most bitter part. The most bitter of nasty, the nastiest part. The nastiest part. Though. It's all the booty at the bottom, you know, the nasty booty at the bottom. The scripture says you're gonna have to drink it at it. And you're gonna be made drunken. You know? So get ready for that. It's coming. It's right around the corner. Right around the corner. Right around the corner. Yeah, you know? Yeah. That's beautiful. Just keep the judgment that the Lord how has the stuff on them. That's right. No. So, you know, just get ready for um, just get ready for slavery. And as for you um, Israelites on the side, we're just going to continue to warn you until um, until the destruction comes to pass. Because the Lord said, you know, we're, we're set up as watchmen. We are the watchmen. We're watching and we're seeing what's going on in the news. Matter of fact. Uh, as uh, Isaiah 2 verse 6, Lord, sure. Sorry, you said that? Now. The book of Isaiah, chapter 62, verse 6. I have set thee watchmen upon thy walls, O Jerusalem. Wait. You just said, I have a. It says, uh, I have set watchmen upon that wall for Jerusalem. So Jerusalem is a people of poor place. So where the people are, the people of black people, the Americans are the people like that's Jerusalem. You know? Because Yahweh said the kingdom of, of, of heaven, you want to defend you. So we, you are the kingdom. So I have set watchmen upon that wall for Jerusalem. So Jerusalem is a people of poor place. What would you be doing? Sorry. Which shall never hold their peace That's right. day nor night. We shall never hold their peace day and night. So at any time of the, of the night or day, you can go on YouTube and watch, and watch different videos, man. Hey, that's how we're not going to hold our peace, man. No, because we know the scriptures from the, the night chapter that the YouTube was created for to preach this gospel. Amen. You know? Keep going, bro. Yay, that make mention. Amen. Yay, yay that make mention. Of the Lord, keep not silent. So we're not gonna keep on silence, man. We're gonna keep prophesying to the Lord until the Lord Yahweh Shalom 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 all these countries are coming up against America in the, um, in the near future. You know what I mean? So we as men of the Lord, we have to come here to warn the people, especially our people, the elect. You know? We shall not keep silent. You know? We're doing it. Because that's why we're constantly making videos week after week, coming out week after week, because we're not keeping silent. You know? That's a that's a duty of a watchman. That's right. To watch to let you know what time it is to, to watch for the enemy. You know, telling you about general trouble, revelation of and call. But people man, they are dumbed down, man. They are in, they are in folly. But they're gonna be destroyed, man. Two thirds have to be destroyed so that so that two thirds have to be destroyed so that the elect is glorified, man. That's right. Uh, Revelation twelve and twelve. Yeah. Therefore rejoice ye heavens, and ye that dwell therein with them. Yeah. Go unto the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea. For the devil has come down onto you, having great wrath, because he knows that he got for a short time. The scripture says, therefore rejoice in heaven, and you that will end up, war brings death destruction to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, and that's what's coming to, to, the, to the world, man. Death destruction, famine, pestilence, man. For the devil, he saw either the, the super white man, it's come down unto you, come down unto who? These people on the side, why? Because they know that he had for a short time, man. No, because the devil knows that the, we are living in the end of the rulership, the power structure, they're going down. Right, you know, they're going down like the brother said, you know. The fact that we are on the corner uh, all over the world, globally, pushing the shoot, teaching the gospel, is a, is a, is a, is a, is a, is a prophecy that the devils are going down, man. Yeah, because, going. For, because 40 years ago, we couldn't, we couldn't do this. 
Exactly. But years ago, we, we, we would have lynched, you know, get lynched for, 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 yeah. for reading the Bible, man. Oh, it's That's right. But it's a new day. It's a new, it's a new, it's a new time, man. The Lord, Yahweh, Jesus Christ, is with the Lord, it's all of you, all over the world, you know, kind of people on the side, some of black Hispanics and Americans to come back to who they are, the culture, the heritage, man. We got you all. But our people, they take the fucking game, man. Yeah. In fact, time of, 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 of this devil, man. You know people are devils, man. Yeah, that's right. Two thirds. Isaiah chapter 42, verse 9. Behold, the former things are come to pass, and new things do I declare. Come. Before they spring forth, I tell you of them. Hey, that's exactly what it is, and that's prophecy. The former things that come to pass, and new things do I declare. Before they spring forth, I tell you of them. That's prophecy, man. We're talking about people like martial law, they have destruction. America going to be destroyed by atomic nuclear destruction, ICBM, by, by Russia, China, uh, 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 Iran, North Korea, man. They think it's a fucking joke. Yeah, it's all it's all fun and games until um it actually happens. You know what I mean? That's that saying goes. It's all fun and games until you see something happen. You know, it's all fun and games. You know, but you know, the people who thought that it was just going to be an ordinary day on 9/11. Look what happened. Yeah, that yeah. destruction is taking place. Likewise yeah, now. Orders. You know, you got Trump over here. He's signing executive orders, you know, to prepare to prepare for EMP attack. Yeah, you know. Yeah. What do you what What are these people gonna do when the EMP actually ha um strikes? Huh. You know, huh. how are they gonna react to that? Yeah. When they can't drive their cars, yeah. there's no electricity. Yeah. No running water. No food coming into these grocery stores. You know. Huh. So it's all fun and games until this, these events actually take come comes to pass. Come, bro. And that's what's gonna make it beautiful, man. Because then they shall know that the prophet has been among them, man. That's right. It's gonna make it beautiful because like all this time we've been telling them that to get right, they they mock us, they laugh at us. You know, they they uh they we said uh, the mark the messenger of the most high and despise prophet till there was no remedy, man. And that's that's exactly the current state of the earth, man. You know, just like the law, the Lord destroyed the world. 2,000 years ago, no, not 2,000 years ago, uh, back in the days when Noah, to the flood, hey, that's exactly what, how it's going to destroy America, man, to the fire. I mean, let me get that, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I, Isaiah, chapter 13, verse 19. And Babylon, the glory of kingdoms, the beauty of the Chaldeans. So they, excellent, excellent. So they said in Babylon, the word Babylon comes from the, the, the Hebrew word Babal, which means confusion. You know, because that's um, what America promoted uh, ever since uh, it's been set in uh, existence, man. Confusion. You know, women, uh, women with women, men with men, that's confusion. That's oh, death. That's not, that's not uh, uh, how the Lord, yeah, how oh, I'm sorry. I set it up. Sorry, right, though. You know, the seed of confusion is broken down. How the seed of confusion is broken down by Bob Kishan? I just have to focus on the seed How the seed of confusion in America is broken down? Hey, to the word, man. To the word of Yahweh Shimon Shai. The weapon of warfare on the corner, but my to the most high to the pulling down of strongholds. So we're exposing these devils, the, the wicked plane, man. There's no order. Man. Isaiah chapter 24, verse 10. Huh. The city of confusion is broken down. So the city of confusion in America is broken down. Broken down by, by the prophets, man. In both 3 and 7, surely the Lord tells nothing but he revealed the secret of the, the prophets. So we explain this place. We let you know our people. Amen. Well, it's not a joke. Bro. It's not a joke. Bro. Bro, if you don't know, if you don't know, right now, ten minutes, ten minutes. what's the point? Well, the Heavenly Father's going to destroy niggas like this, man. Oh, bro, bro. Playing these games, man. <laughs> joke, man. Yo, the, the Heavenly Father is going to come down with great wrath. See, that's Yo, what's going on, people? Brother. You know? Because all our people want to do is just play games, you know? This is not a game right here. We're talking prophecy. We're preaching the downfall of America. The Heavenly Father is getting ready to raise up peace to come against these things. Yes. Don't be surprised if a nigga gets, um, if he gets shot, you know, on 12 o'clock news. Yeah, man. Don't, don't be surprised, you know? Niggas like that because the Esau, the most I gonna raise up Esau to come against these niggas. Yeah, come bro. Niggas like that are the reason why with this condition that we as a people, man. They wanna be niggas. They wanna they wanna be under the rulership of the devils, man. 
They don't want to repent. They don't want to get right. They want to. They want to do everything that the devil has put on his, uh, in his uh, in his uh, in, in his media, man. These are these are zombies, man. There it is. He here it is. Instead of trying to learn and trying to ask questions and trying to learn about his inheritance, he has the richest inheritance. We have the most richest inheritance on the face of the planet. Yet you want to fucking play games, you know? I did like this is a, a BT shoot, you know? A, a music video shoot, you know? A hip hop shoot, you know? This is not a hip hop music video thing, you know? So this is serious business for the rich and the downfall of America. It's a life and death situation. It's a life and death situation. You know? Esau's getting ready to raise up and come and bring all kind of havoc upon, upon America. There it is when instead of trying to take heed to um take heed to the sound doctrine that we're preaching, you want to play games. You know, I mean I mean all right, so this is a, um, Ecclesiastes chapter 5, verse 1. And it says, Keep thy foot when thou go to the house of the Most High. Huh? Hey, the house of the Most High is here, man. Well, just to say the house I said, when two or three are God in my name, they are in the midst, man. So these people, they, they are they are committing uh, uh, sin. They are committing sin without even knowing it, man. Talking trash about about us is like talking trash to the Lord, man. Because we're the prophet, that's the servant that the Lord has raised up to tell all people to get right. But they, they mock us. But it's all right, though. One, two, three, and be more ready to hear than give sacrifice of fools. So be now be, be more ready to hear than to give sacrifice of a fool, because. The majority of our people, they are four, man. This is the same as uh, Hosea 4 and 10. My people are just short for lack of knowledge. The so called black spirits and the Americans are just short for lack of knowledge, man. That's why, that's why you're in this condition that you're in right now as a people. For they consider not the evil they do, the, they, not that they do evil. Yeah, they, they consider not they do evil, man. These people, our people are wise in, the, in, the, in, the, in, the, in their ignorance, man. Verse 2 Be not rash with thy mouth. And let not thy heart be hasty to utter anything before the Most High. Huh, keep going, bro. For the Most High is in heaven and thou upon the earth. Yeah, come, come on. Therefore, let thy words be few. Come, let thy words be few when you come to the prophet, to the servant of the Lord, man. You know? Because, like, my people, I mean, they don't see, like, uh, just like because they don't see anybody in them, when they see us, they don't see anybody in us. Why? Because we are, we are, we, we, we look like them. We look like them, you know? We, we come, we live in the same neighborhood as they do. We live in the same neighborhood as they do. I mean, like, it's just like that. That's it on that, That's why it's just that's it on that, you know? Because at the end of the day, he, he was doing evil. And this is not the first time he, he's coming up, you know? Every time he passes amongst the camp, say, Amen! Amen! Like, you know? Then he's trying to get up in the, in the in, in our space, you know? Getting up on the camera saying the same thing. He's not, he doesn't know that he's doing evil. He doesn't know. You know? know? Jeremiah 4, 4, 2. Jeremiah 4 verse 22 For my people is foolish They have not for me They are solid children They have not understanding They are wise to do evil But to do good they have no knowledge That's right, they're wise to do evil you know? Coming up and disrupting the camp Disrupting the word of Yahweh Shimei outside Or you know? going out, you know Out there trapping Or whatever they, they may be doing You know you know, they're wise to when, it comes, when it comes to get right, you know, when it comes to turn away and to put off, you know, what you're doing, they don't want to do it, you know? When it comes to coming back to these lost actions and commandments and start rehearsing, you know, these lost actions and commandments, they don't want to do it. Or ban Yahweh by Shim Shai, they don't want to do it, you know? But yet they want to get up here, you know, and want to do all types of foolishness and fooling, you know? Yeah. 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 Yeah.
But to the group, they have no knowledge. Right. You know, they have no love. You know, they don't want to come back to the heavenly father. They don't want to take heed to the prophecies. You know, of the destruction of America. You know, they want to. They want. They want to come up here. They want to act the fool. You know, want to act stupid. But the heavenly father got your number. You know, the heavenly father got your number. You know. You think that Yahweh Bashim Yahweh tries playing games? He got your number. Because at the end of the day, the angels are watching everything that's that's what's going on and reporting it back to the Lord. And the Lord is reporting it to the Heavenly Father. You know? In Mosh chapter 9, verse 11, and he reads. No, no, no. The Lord, I'll Visible? Yeah, eight. Yeah, eight. 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 And I will destroy it from the face of the earth. Yeah, so the ain't so the most high's eyes are upon the sinful kingdom. And who are the most high's eyes? The angels. You know? All the archangels. That's why you see in the chariots that's going up around the four corners of the earth. Because those are the na- those are the angels. those are the um those are the eyes of the heavenly father, which are the angels, you know? Those are those those are the heavenly father's eyes and ears, you know, the angels. You know, it says, uh, Behold, the eyes of the Lord power are upon the sinful kingdom, and I will destroy it from the face of the earth, uh, saving that I will not destroy the house of Jacob, said the Lord. That's right, saying I will not utterly destroy the whole house of Jacob, said the Lord, because there's only a like few that's going to make it out of here. You know, only a, 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 an elect number, which are the elect 144,000, is going to be delivered. You know? And all Israel will be saved through the through the Lord's elect. That's how all Israel will be saved. I mean, that's why we, because they're gonna have to perish here and come back to the loins of the elect. So reincarnation, reincarnation. Yeah. That's what you want to work. That's what you want to work. That's right. You know? That's why. That's why we have that fear. You know. That's why the Most High put it in us to continue to do the work and to come out. You know, at the prophesied downfall of America. You know. That's why we're out here, you know. That's why you see your brothers, you know, in particular GMS putting up videos, three videos a week, you know, doing shows, you know, coming out on um day on Saturdays, coming out natural days. Why? So this word can be pushed out even more. Because we're pushing this word out even more. So it's like, yeah, come because like uh the vibration that we're pushing is uh changing the mindset of the people, man. That's right, you know. That they may go to the gates of the nobles. That's why we're shaking the hand for the devil, you know? Devil. We're lifting our voice. Let me get that real quick. Is that the one? Yeah. And I'll get it Isaiah chapter 58, verse 1. Cry out loud. Fair not. They said cry out loud, it's fair not. So that's why when we come out here, we don't give a damn how you see us. We're going to cry out to, to, to our people, man. You know, because we, we understand that the, the elect are going to be among among the, the marketplace, man. The, the chief place of commerce, you know? That's right. Cry out loud, spare not, mm-hmm. lift out that voice like a trumpet, uh-huh. and show my people their transgression. Show my people their transgression. What's the dress? What is transgression? The, the breaking of the law of the Lord, Yahweh Shimon Shai. And that's why we, we as a people, so called black and Hispanics and Native Americans, are in this state, in this condition that we're in right now. Why? Because we broke the law of Yahweh Shimon Shai. And it just says, uh, the scripture says, to whom much is given, much is required, man. So the, we, 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 we go aside. We for super powers are not punished for that nation, man. That's right. No. And the house of Jacob, their sin. And the house of Jacob, their sin. What is sin? Sin is a transgression of the law. So when, when you break the law, that's how we sin. Who are throwing 
Yes. It's alright. So for black spirits in America, that's why again we're in this position that we're in right now because we brought the law behind our shy. We created all kind of African, you know? Right. Right. You see, you see that demon? What's breaking the law? I'm seeing it. Yeah, breaking the law is when you come against these law statutes and commandments of the heavenly father. You know? No, no, but what breaking the law is when you when you when you cast the, the, the word of the Lord, the Hamas you shine. When you do what's contrary what's contrary to the law, that's how you break the law. That's right. That's how you break the law. Yeah. When you when you when you eat pork, you know, yeah, eat pork. Eat pork, commit adultery, yeah. you know. Come. That's that's you transgression the law. That's transgression of the law. You know? Of the law. You know, all these abominable things. Yeah, you know. When you, when, you, when, you, when you sleep with your 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 your, your, your neighbor's wife, that's right. That's why. You, that's how you move the law. Yeah, that's transgression, right there. You know, yeah. that's breaking the law. Yeah. You know, when you commit homosexuality, you know that's 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 that's, that's, that's how you broke the law. That's you know? right. You know. And when you ask these pastors in these churches, another thing too, they claim to be men of the Lord, but when you ask them what is sin, they can't even answer it according to the scripture. There it is, it's right there in the scriptures, but yet they don't want to answer. First John, right? Yeah, first John. Yeah, whosoever committed sin, transgressed out of the law, for sin, transgressed out of the law. Yeah, come on. You know, very simple, right there. But yet these pastors, when they're in these churches, they, when somebody asks them what's sin, they can't break it down. You know, because they were set up by Yahweh. That's right. Because you know? they were set up by Christians. That's, That's right. why you have something called a theology seminary. Yep. You know, the Bible wants C two tax strata. Yeah. You know, because at the end of the day, these pastors they know who we are as a people. They know, but they can't tell you because they're under that five hundred one C two tax strata. Yeah. Why? Because they want that fucking money. That's why. Yeah. You know, <laughs> like an elder, I know I'm saying, you know, they want their fucking money. You know, that, that, that's all about. They're all about the vengeance, you know. They're not about to. Yeah. That's why these pastors, when they get up, that's why I was watching this one video, because um, brother that's not affiliated, you know, they put up um, videos about the any um, about these pastors, you know. And you have one pastor that's actually in conjugation. You know, for um, for um, for an, um, for a uh, Falcon X7, which is a um private jet. You know, but it's, 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 it's not the most, but it's it's, 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 it's expensive private jet, which could travel real fast. You know, they could get to their destination real quickly. You know, so you got these pastors. You know, these televangelist pastors. You know, they want to talk about oh, you know, there was this one pastor by the name of Kenneth Copeland. You gonna say, well, I don't. I, the reason why I have like three or five planes in my hangar, you know, private jets, because I don't like flying commercials, because there's a lot of demons in the um, in the in the, um, in the commercial airlines, you know. So he himself, yeah, he himself is a demon, you know. And it's excuses because I want to have a long time to talk to God, you know. I want to have my own private place so I can talk privately to God. You know, there's a lot of demons in commercial airlines. You know? Well, here it is. You know, here it is. You know, the other apostles of GMS, you know, they didn't, they didn't need a plane to fly over the, the whole world to preach the gospel. And yet, you got brothers waking up all over the world, you know, by the way of the internet, you know? So there's no excuse, you know? And these are jets, these, these private jets, they're like, they're going for like at least 65 million a pop. You know, you got to be rich to, to afford to get one of them. Yeah, you know? that's how you you got to be rich. You got to be heavy, rolling heavy, you know? Yeah, done. Because like we just read earlier, won't you that are rich or you have received a consolation, right? Yeah, so done. These pastors, false, false prophets, you know, they have received a consolation. That's right. They were set up by Esau, Edom, the devil, to see the, 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 the majority of these people on the side. And they have just done that, you know? Yeah, done, you know? Yeah. That's why, let me, let me get that real close, bro. Jeremiah chapter twenty um, Jeremiah chapter twenty three and one. Woe be unto the pastors that destroy and scatter the sheep of my pastors. Says the woe be. Bible to show. Read it again one more time. Right. Um. Jeremiah chapter 23, verse 1. Woe be unto the pastors that destroy and scatter the sheep of my pastors, says the Lord. Woe be unto the pastors that destroy and scatter the sheep. Who are the sheep? 
the lordship of the house of Israel. So these pastors, they have uh, received uh, uh, benefits, you know, of, of five months of charter to be sure these people understand, so-called black spinnings and the Americans, which are indeed the Israelites, the people that, that wrought uh, the red right to Moses, man. That's right. The, the yeah. truth coming out right now. The truth coming out in the latter days because it says in the last day knowledge shall be increased, man. That's what you see. That's what you see people are uh, waking up to the truth, man. But these pastors, man, but the, these pastors, these pastors, they cannot tell the truth, right? Because they are, they, they are in, in vibration. They are in link with them devil. Yeah, can't. There it is. They got you know. They got the televangelists, which they got satellites that's going throughout the four corners of the earth. So hey. you mean to tell me? That you already got a system that's already preaching a murder already, but yet you need a private jet to fly, you know, to try to preach the gospel. Yeah, that's, Come how on, know, man. that's how you know Christianity is not the way. That's right. Says, and the gospel of the kingdom shall be preached all the way up on which to our nation, and then shall James come. So Christianity had been, had been preaching for almost a thousand years ago. The end is not. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. The, the end has not yet come. Why? Because that's not that's not that's not the doctrine. That's not the way. Yeah, that's not the truth. That's not the truth. Yeah, because we already got the tools, you know, that um, from the elders, apostles on down. Already got the tools to preach to um, get the word out. You know. Yeah, no. And you see brothers waking up all over the world. Yeah. So the the elder apostles didn't didn't have to get a private jet or raise money to get a private jet to come on and preach. Wake up brothers all all the four corners of the earth. We got the internet. Yeah, no. We put up the Lord. We put up the Lord. Yeah, how about you try? Does the heavy work for us? That's right. All right. So this is um, Psalms chapter nineteen, verse one. Mm -hmm. The heavens declare their glory mm -hmm. of the Most High, yeah. and the firmament show up His handiwork. The, the heaven, the, the satellite of them, man. That's yeah. how you know the glory of, of the Lord. Yeah, how about you try? Because every day, this day was I discover new planets, man. That's right. New, new planets that are, that are more uh, ten times. Uh, 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 bigger than the earth, man. The heavens, the satellites. Oh, that's right. Declare the handy work of the Alba Shimon That's how you use them like that. Everywhere you go in the world, you can watch documentaries on the marvelous work of the Alba Shimon Shah. We call God and Jesus Christ. Those are Hebrew men, dark skinned men. who are going to come to the Shah America. Right. Verse 2. Day on um, day unto day are the speech, and night unto night show of knowledge. Day unto day are his speech, and now unto night show of knowledge, man. To the YouTube, the, the unicorn. That's how this knowledge is being pushed all over the world, man. That's right. No? There is no there is no speech nor language where their voices is not heard. That's why they, they know it as a, the World Wide Web, w, the World Wide Web. So they shoot uh, the internet. Everybody, you know, even in a so-called cave or Afghanistan, have access to the internet, man. That's how the shoe is gonna push so-called black spirits in the Americas are, are the Israelites, the people of the Lord. Verse four: Their line is gone out through all the earth. Yes, the line. The line. What is uh, that line? The satellite. The satellite. You know, they they have the a, had something a while ago. America's online AOL. Yeah, AOL. <laughs> yeah, America's online. That's, that's yeah. a lie. That's a lie. Yeah. 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 And their words to the end of the world. And the words to the end of the world, man. To the internet, the YouTube. That's how, that's how this word was uh, set up to be to be go out, man. Yeah, that's right. And them have he set up a tabernacle for the sun. The tabernacle for the sun, man. See, that's that internet, you know. Internet. So why 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 in the fuck do you need a a sixty million dollar a sixty five million dollar jet, you know, to fly all over the world just to preach the word, you know? Where you already have the tools, where your how about shot, you shot, already set up the tools to do so. You yeah. know, that's why we got brothers that's waking up all four corners of the earth. You know, yeah. which is amazing. amazing. And that's through the spirit and power of your how about shot. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. That's, that's through the spirit. You know, the elder apostles didn't have to, you know, raise up money yeah. or to get uh, to try to get their um, a private jet so they can fly all over the world to just, just to preach the word. You know? Most I already gave it to them. No. So these, these jets that these pastors are rolling in, these jets are going like for like 50, 65 million dollars a pop. So there's no excuse. That's why these pastors they don't be destroyed. Back your book. So Baruch chapter 5 verse, uh, verse 5 and it reads, Arise O Jerusalem and sit on high and look about toward the east and behold, and behold, thy children gather from the west unto the east by the word of the Holy One, rejoicing in the remembrance of the Most High Yahweh That's right. So the Most High is gathering, you know, through the word, you know, to the unicorn, which is the um, 
which is the satellite, he's gathering the, uh, the elect from all from the four corners of the earth, from the east to the west, yeah. you know, the north to the south, you know, all over. You know, you got brothers up in Canada, you got brothers in Central America and Mexico teaching, you know. In Peru, you got brothers out there. Yeah. Yeah. The UK, you know? The UK, yeah. South, Central, Central Africa. Yeah, South Africa, Central Africa, South yeah. Africa. Yeah. The West Coast parts of Af Ghana, West Africa. West Africa, yeah. You know? All over the world, you know? Yeah. And, and the end is, uh, the, the end is near. <laughs> the end is near. Yeah. Like the brother said, and the end is near. Yeah. Because brothers are, are waking up all over the world, you know? To the ways of the internet. But with that, you know, we want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahshua, Bashim, and the modesty they had to pass to the great most on that rule well. Salutations to Yahweh out there on the highways and byways. Until then, we want to say Shalom, Shalom, Bom Yahshua, Allah, Nashua, Allah, Baba, 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 Baba.